I'm super excited for what we got going on today. I got two of my favorite rods out here and we're gonna do a cast distance and action performance test comparison on the two rods. One is a seven foot fast action medium heavy spinning rod and the other one is a seven foot moderate fast action medium heavy bait cast rod. Now, as far as cast distance is concerned, I understand there's some people that think bait cast rods and their peak performance can cast further than spinning rods, but we're gonna neglect those because to be honest, if there is a difference, it's a couple feet. Today, we're gonna be looking at yards uh, and, and quite a big distance between moderate fast and fast action. And one of my favorite parts about today is I brought the drone along, so we're gonna send it up and we're gonna get an aerial shot of how far each rod can cast. All right, so now we're gonna see what the difference is in the distance between a fast action rod and a moderate fast action rod for casting. So here goes the moderate fast action seven foot bait cast rod. Now we're gonna look at the seven foot spinning rod that's fast action. Remember, both of these rods are casting the same bait, the same down south lure on the same owner jig head. They each have 20 pound braid, both power pro. Uh, so it all comes down to the rod action. And then if you wanna argue the bait cast versus spinning, but that honestly comes down to the angler's ability. So now we've seen the distance from the air. The moderate fast action definitely casts further on average. The fast action just can't quite keep up. Now in most cases though, you might be able to cast more accurately with a fast action rod. So if you're fishing in tight quarters, if you don't need cast distance and you want sensitivity, then fast action is probably the way to go. If you're fishing open water, you're kind of trying to cover a lot of ground, and you need every inch that you can gain, a moderate fast will probably be the best application for you. That being said, there are a number of other things to think about uh, when picking an action in a rod fast versus moderate fast. Uh, you might want to keep in mind how strong of a hook set you need or want or don't want, depending on the type of fish that you're targeting. So keep these things in mind next time you're picking out action in a, in a rod.